What's up, homie? It's day 23 and we've lost all hope. No, no wait, it's day three of drag week and it's like five o'clock in the morning and we're loading up, ready to head out to Atco Dragway in New Jersey. Um, New Jersey looks like everywhere else in America except like really bad drivers. Uh, so it's a bit of a challenge getting around. But we battle on. And here's the star of the show, Mr. Benjamin. What up? pumping the tank out at the moment into uh, one of the jerry cans we've got spare. So this is a mix of E85 and 93, okay. whatever, whatever dregs were in the tank. So I'm just gonna pump it into the jerry. And once once the back's on the ground and the front's up, I'm actually gonna pump it again. Then I'm gonna put a couple of liters of E85 in it, circulate it, and then pump it out yet again. Once that's done, we're gonna fill the tank all the way to the top. And then we should have pretty pretty good ethanol content for today, so we'll probably do the same with the Mustang as well. Happy birthday to that Kiwi guy. Happy birthday to you. What's the story with arachnids fornication? There isn't any. Welcome to Drag Week 2019, day three. We're here at Atco Dragway. We've again made it here super early. We were actually one, two in the line, but the dudes at Street Machine actually asked us to not run together. Uh, it's actually a lot easier for those guys to cover all the Aussie stuff if we're not side by side. So and we've, um, and Woody, and Woody. So we've let uh, one of these G bodies in. It's actually uh, a made of mats from CPS, so it's a pretty cool car. It's got an LSX in it. Uh, I think it went high eights yesterday, so it'll be pretty similar time to the Cresta, I believe. It's, uh, it's a pretty cool car. I quite like the, uh, the Buick Regal body style. There's some uh, quite nice G bodies floating around here. Uh, there's also a super clean uh, Turbo 6 variant here as well. Uh, a lot of those actually came with a Turbo 3.8 litre. Uh, any Aussies would probably be familiar with that engine or a similar version of that engine from the VN Commodore. Uh, but enough of that Commodore chat. We're going to get on the track pretty soon and hopefully today we're going to be one and done. So, fingers crossed. And hopefully today we're not going to be here for five hours changing a map sensor. No more page ups, mate. No, we're paging down, actually. Turn it down. It's going to get slower. We're one passing out of here. Yeah, that's it. And then a little nap before dinner. You're going to use your brain, mate. I'm gonna use my brain, have a little nap before dinner, and then we're gonna have a beer. Yeah. This would go really well with your hat, Woody. You reckon it would? I reckon it would. I reckon I could actually tie that around your hat. Well. Do it. Put it on. Put it on. Looking pretty good. Throw the leg up, mate.
161.5159. We're back on our one and done plan. Just gone uh, 9.0 at 149. So pretty good. It's within a tenth of the best of the car at Drag Week this year. Pretty happy with that. Uh, Brendan's also gone 9.0. He spun a little bit off the line, but we're pretty happy still with that number. It's not it's not worth sending the car out again. Um, we can definitely fix that up on day five because we're going to be chucking it at it and we can do as many passes as we want before we hand in a time card. So we're uh, pretty much going to pack up, get on the road. Might hang out for a little bit, but we're not going to. We're definitely not going to be here till one o'clock today. So pretty keen to get on the road and just take it a bit easier and have a chill out at the accommodation this afternoon instead of wrenching all, all day in the sun and then having to power through the evening to get to where we should have been four hours before. So we'll uh, finish up here and then we're going to get on the road. What's up, Mike? Good morning. How are you? Another late night. Yeah? 3 a.m. into the hotel, 4.30 in the hotel yesterday. You love it, don't you? Oh, dude. I wouldn't be anywhere else right now. <laughs> Didn't have to guess today, the uh, old mate here is just going to let us fill up and pay at the end. It's like almost like we're in Australia. It's almost like this is a much more efficient system. That was quite full, Benny. Yeah, nailed it. You right there, bro? Yeah, I'm having cheesy pulls. Arrived at the first checkpoint for the day. There's already tons of cars here. Cool sights, and we've got a bit of a power plant in the background. Uh, it's nice to see a bit of water as well. It's a nice little breeze rolling off that, so it's cooling us down a bit. Boys are cruising around too. They're um, keeping their distance from us. We kind of had an unofficial, can't have support vehicles, even though we we're using it as a camera car. Someone's obviously made like a, a minor complaint about it or whatever, but that's all right. We're, we weren't doing anything wrong, so having the car not with us doesn't actually affect us at all. Um, so they're basically running ahead. We just say hi and then keep going. So yeah, now it's time to go to the next checkpoint. Um, yeah, as I said, there's tons of cars here and they're, they're all moving out straight away, pretty much snap and go, whereas we stopped for a bit of lunch. So we'll uh, get back on the road because apparently there's still another two hours to go. So fingers crossed. I'm loving it, mate. I'm loving it. 
Having a few jacks in the car. Birthday boy, good on ya. Mm. Gotta celebrate somehow. We have run out of jacks though, and it's a problem in America. We can't get them anywhere. We haven't run out yet. Well, we're close. <laughs> That's two more drinks, man. Yeah, where's that moonshine going? How far are we gonna go? Gonna go? And then there won't be a spirit shop because they just help flip it. Bro, I'm pretty sure they sell it here. Look at the window. Mate. Dude, there's bourbon on the window. You show me, because I couldn't find it. I'll be back. Australia. Oh, I think we're starting to get them. I thought it was an LFA at first. That's sick. Cheers. Check out the radar on the boot. Or maybe that's ANPR. What's ANPR? Number plate recognition. You can't recognise these number plates. Maybe when he drove past it went bing, bing, bing. Yeah, he probably peeked out. What the hell? Where are y'all from? <laughs> Zane's going for a power nap, oh. maybe, a, maybe a power spew, we're not oh. really sure. <laughs> Happy birthday Zane. Yeah, he's been on the jacks, he's feeling it. <laughs> and how's your day been? Stinky? Oh, I've got sore eyeballs from wind blowing in it. Yep. Feels like welding flash. Just Yo. How you doing bro? Just watching a bit of uh, Street Machine Drag Week coverage because oh, nice. they're quicker at editing videos than us. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> They are, they do pump them out. Yeah. Talk to those, those dudes, editors. Yeah. Legends. Bloody legends all around with Street Machine homies. But uh, yeah, we were on day three. We've had a pretty good run today. Um, did one pass each. Yeah. So we both went 9-0. Uh, Maddie or someone forgot to put the, take the filters off. No great deal. We'll be Where sweet. Be? I always get blamed for shit. I don't know. I don't know who's. I don't think we actually delegated someone to do it. So. I'll take the blame for that, actually. Uh, well, first in line again. Yeah, first in line. Both went 9-0. Um, not bad. It's not really going to affect anyone's average. So um, Benny's still going to end up with an 8-second average, and I will, will be bottom 9. So hopefully tomorrow, if I can do like an 8-80, that might put me into an 8-90 average. And then day 5, we'll uh, try and get an 8-50 or something, it, somewhere close to that, um, to hand in. And then that'll hopefully try and bring my average down to like an 870 or an 860. I'm not that good at maths. But you know yeah. what the track is like tomorrow? Oh, every day that everyone says, oh, the next track tomorrow is the best track all week. And then that's what made Evil Knievel try and put the rods out of his motor. So <clears throat> He's also watching Street Machine. So now we've had a really good run. Uh, everyone's happy. The drive was longer today, but it didn't feel as bad. Um, I don't know if the route was a little bit easier. Um, yesterday we kind of got a little bit lost on the route and one of the rules is you have to actually go back to the same point so there was a lot of backtracking and mucking around doing the route. Um, we're pretty mindful this year of doing the route exactly as it's on the paper. Um, there's already been mention of a couple of people sort of shorting it and Hot Rod are aware of it and they're uh, watching everyone pretty closely so we're very mindful of now following that basically to the letter and not, not uh, taking ourselves out of the race by navigation fail so we uh, definitely want to finish legitimately um, I mean if you short the route you're only cheating yourself really um, gonna win that drum of fuel. I'm not gonna win a drum of 100 that I can't even use um, but it, you, our class doesn't get a drum of fuel anyway but that's neither here nor there um, yeah good day all around we're happy we're all tired it's like five o'clock or something so we're gonna pack up have a shower and all get in the pool. I'm not sure what order that's going to go in. And it's Zane's birthday. And it's Zane's birthday. Celebrate with Zane. Zane's American birthday. 
It's September 11th today too, and uh, being in America two years in a row for September 11th is kind of a bit surreal. So yeah, we're uh, thinking of everyone about that today. And there was a bit of a mention of it at Drag Week this morning, and I'd actually forgotten about it to be honest. And then they reminded us this morning, so it's kind of been on my mind today a little bit. And um, yeah, thinking of everyone that that lost their lives in that event. So um, yeah, it's something to think about, but. I don't want to get too bogged down in political stuff, but we're um, yeah having a good time, and we're going to get back on the road tomorrow morning and try and get the first car down the track again. So we didn't we deliberately didn't actually run together today. Um, Street Machine asked us if we could run separately so that they could cover it better. So it'll uh, probably end up for a better video tonight, which we'll watch tomorrow morning, and you guys will watch way before you've watched this video. So thanks for watching both the videos. See you guys tomorrow.